righty, ladies and gentlemen, was reading some of that wrestling news, and um, Raw got a 2.20 rating. A 2.2. Holy shit. Shit's getting fucking low, man. Um, I think last year it went to a 2.2, and everybody was freaking out about this. You know what I'm saying? It was a 2.2. It was, it was that football season, shit like this there. At, when it gets real low in the October, November area there, um, <laughs> people were freaking out. Now, not even a month past WrestleMania, already a 2.2 rating. Holy shit. Um, Roman Reigns, boy. Roman Reigns, was that a great decision? To put Roman Reigns as the champ. You know, nobody likes the guy. Let's push him anyway. Uh, love it or leave it. You know, we're going to push who we want. Fuck the fans. Is that a good move, this? To go from a 2.9 to a 2.2 there? Is that a good move? To push a guy that sucks? I'm not a good guy. I'm not a bad guy, I'm the guy. Was that your answer? You push a guy that sucks simply because they have a muscle fetish there in this company, a weirdo motherfucking muscle fetish. They push a guy that sucks, a guy that the crowd doesn't like because they have a muscle fetish and their, their way of, of, of dealing with, with the backlash was I'm not a good guy, not a bad guy. I'm the guy. Like I said before, he is the guy that is losing fucking ratings. That is what this man is doing. Are they fucking mental? Are they psycho? Let's push a guy that sucks and tell the fans to fuck off. That's gonna help. Let's get some of the lowest ratings we've ever had there. Just so we can prove some kind of psycho point to the fans there. Prove that we we don't know what's best for business. You know what I'm saying? Um, these boring shows haven't helped as well. The first week it was cool there. Sami Zayn, stuff like this. They brought out Baron Corbin. They brought out Apollo Crews. Okay, this is cool. Some new guys. But every fucking show was identical. Identical. The guys placed in every match the same fucking way. It was like the first show. And then it was just cheaper versions of the same show all fucking month. Where the fuck do you expect to go with this? You know what I mean? Holy fuck. How low can you go? How fucking low are they going to go with this garbage fucking bullshit? Oh my fucking God, this is bad. Very bad. Oh, let's, let's tell the fans that Shane McMahon is in charge there. And he's there for the people or whatever. Let's just have Shane go out there, do absolutely nothing there. Just pretend that he's going to change stuff. Let's just make the fans believe there that there's a hope for change with Shane. And what do you get? Oh, it's the era of the Roman Empire, like, like that dumbass was saying. Roman Reigns. And what's the Roman Empire? It's going down. You know, the Roman Empire collapsed back in the day there. And WWE might collapse as well there. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? They, they want to talk about reaching the, the brass ceiling. Eventually, they're going to fucking collapse and, and, and go to the fucking sewers. That's where they're going to go there. How low can you go, motherfucker? Uh, put a fucking bum as your champion and say fuck the fans. You get a 2.2, that's what you deserve. They're lucky to to have a 2.2. Fucking shit was so horrible, I couldn't watch it. 
And I've been watching this shit for 30 years. Last night, I just could not fucking watch it anymore. And it looks like other fans were feeling the same way there. Fuck your garbage champion, he sucks. The company needs to wake the fuck up before shit gets embarrassing there. Before they go down to TNA level fucking viewers there. And it can happen. Until next time, peace!